Christmas time, don't fly too high. Be sure to keep the ground in sight. So hey guys, welcome back to my channel for tutorials. So guys, today I'll teach you how to create new style of logo particle animation with using RG Trap Code plugin. See guys, that's my beautiful new style of logo animation. It's really simple. Okay, so guys, now I teach you how I create this type of beautiful animation. So guys, stop and I create new composition. So go to on file and create new project. So guys, composition create new guys duration 10 second is good so press ok yes and guys i have logo so import your logo see guys that's my logo png format file so import yeah so guys select your background simple drag and drop yes right and guys see that's my logo so simple drag and drop yeah okay so next one guys lock this layer that's my background and guys select your logo layer so go to one effect and presets and type liner select your liner web and apply to logo yes so guys go to on zero frame and guys press u select this one delete so guys i go to like a seven second seven second and guys transaction i like 100 yes so guys go to back and play okay see guys that's my simple line of web animation and now guys i increase feather like a 50 is good enter so guys again go to back and play yes right that's really simple okay so guys now select your logo and duplicate press ctrl d and guys this time delete your line of web delete and guys this time i create masking so guys select your logo top one and click on here and guys select your this one that's my rectangle selection tool so guys select your logo and i quit masking like this yeah and guys go to like a zero frame and mask path that's my mask path check and now guys go to like a seven second seven and mask guys go to on here so select your rectangle so holding shift key so go to on here like this yeah that's it guys so guys go to back and play yeah that's my simple masking okay so guys now all is good and little bit up so guys this time i create precom so click on here and guys right click guys precomposition like a logo text actually logo mask yeah and guys move all attribute check and press ok ok so guys all is good and guys select this mask layer and create 3d yes and hide this layer hide ok so guys next one i create particle layer so new solid layer like a particle enter yes and guys go to effect and preset and now guys i apply particular this one plugin yeah and guys go to on animator so guys see that's my type i use layer yes and guys see that's my layer animator i use this time logo mask layer check yes right and guys now i increase particle so particle 5 and 5 times 0 2 3 4 5 enter yes guys more enter yes see guys that's my particles okay so guys now i change velocity velocity like a 50 is good and guys now go to on here that's my particle so life second i like 1.5 yes and life random i like 100 percent and now guys go to on particle type i use cloud this one yes that's my cloud and feather i like zero yes and see guys that's my size random i take same 100 percent yes okay so guys now go to on size over life i like guys change preset i like this one yes and now guys go to on all is good so go to on shading and see guys that's my shadow on and on yes that's good and guys go to on 
physics so guys i show you my animation so guys go to back and play okay so guys now i change resolution like the auto so guys go to back and play yes see guys that's my simple beautiful particles and stop guys go to on physical and guys here go to on turbulence field see guys that's my effect size i like 20 and effect position i like 200 enter yes and guys fade in time i like 0 0.1 enter yes and scale this one guys scale 10 is good okay so guys all is good and now guys go to on render rendering and motion blur check motion blur i see that's my motion blur i like on yes that's my motion blur so guys go to back and play yes see guys that's my really cool dynamic effect and now guys all is good and this time guys i create background particle so stop so guys i change resolution i have to like full for better preview and now guys select your particle layer so duplicate press ctrl d yes so guys go to down and guys rename like a particle bg that's my background and now guys i increase emitter size so emitter velocity i like 500 that's my particle and guys particle count i like 2 and 5 times 0 yes and guys all is good so guys play yes see guys that's my really cool dynamic effect and now guys i apply this time sharp effect and glow effect on particle so select your particle first and like a sharp select your sharp layer and apply to particle guys amount i like 100 is good and guys same particle background sharp and apply and guys amount same 100 enter yes and next one guys this time i apply also glow effect on background glow and apply to background layer background particle so guys threshold i like 80 and radius i like guys take a 60 and low intensity 1.5 is good for me okay so guys all is good that's my beautiful particle so guys increase frame yes that's my beautiful particles okay so guys all is good that's my final work it's take little bit time for preview okay so guys that's it my work is finished so if you like my video please share and please subscribe my youtube channel and guys you can download this project file template from my website it's free thank you